Okay, so this one is um the big the big issue with this one. You have the trend on the garage door. Um, the big one is this one is it's a busier street. Okay. Is this your thirty-five hundred dollars house? No. Oh, I wish. It looks kind of. Like <laughs> oh no. It's not that bad. No, this was actually fifty. Um, but this really? is almost an acre. Oh right, because of the lot. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's almost an acre, and it's part, it's like we're in. It's like we're in schools. It's a very good like... school district. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. So it's. Um, How old is the house? The original part of the house you can kind of see was. Yeah, um, yeah. I think it might have been this little peak. Yeah. Say, it's hundred years old. Yeah, it's a hundred years old. This side. And then they, that addition is actually newer and it's fine. This side has actually got some leveling issues inside. Ray's already been in it. So he's already determined that no problem. By the time I'm done with it, you won't even be able to tell. There's not going to be anything out oh, of the level. So it's not structural or foundation no. or anything like that? No, okay. just it's kind of like, you know, it wasn't it, the scansion post and stuff in the basement. Uh, it doesn't have the right support. So it's kind of, I mean, he'll get all that braced up up to code yeah, he's, a build, yeah. he's a license builder oh, very good. but then see this, this garage is a nice right. size garage but it is really ugly so of course that would all be sided all new roof yes totally um, new garage doors yeah so uh, normally what i would ask debbie is like what do you think but what i did is i go through and i estimate and i took a pad yesterday with me and i want to see what she says today because i didn't bring mine with me I want to see if she comes up with the same numbers I do. She's, right. like I said, she's more conservative. So, so you replace, replace the windows or just side open? Yeah, no, no, new windows. Okay. I put a thousand bucks in for the windows in here. And then new garage door, obviously, with all the mechanicals and hardware. Although I may not even need the windows when they side over them. You just side over them. That's what I've done in, in old. I'd house. probably do that. Pontiac, yeah. Yeah, I'd probably just do that. You're, that's right. Actually, that'd save me a thousand bucks. Yeah. Because they're about two fifty a window. Yeah. Um, and then, and then the garage doors usually. Usually a garage door is about 900 to 1000 to install a new one like this, but because there's going to be some framing involved, right. I estimated 1500 bucks. Yeah. Well, that gives me a cushion. What do you want in Pontiac? It was 1500 bucks. Yep. They took the big carriage doors off. And yeah. Yes, yeah. yes. And then if they got a frame, then you know that's it's going to be more. But it's got a beautiful backyard. Um, look at it. It's, it's really, this is very country. I mean, look at people are hanging yeah. their stuff. And that's, that's actually probably a detriment. And this is all this a lot here. But. It goes way back. Wow. Um, but anyway, so what I'm going to do is I'll, I'm going to put a new roof on to make it look contemporary. Uh, we finished siding. Right. Yep. Reside the rest of this. Reside the garage to match. New garage door. Uh, and Debbie doesn't. What Debbie doesn't know is the back door is not locked. It's um doesn't lock, so she went all the way through the front. Oh, maybe it does now. I got to fix. Oh, well, we'll go through the front. And no, I thought you, it was broken yesterday. Have you closed on this already? No, this one I just got the offer signed today. Hey, Deb, I was going to ask you to, to start throwing out your estimate number so Dennis can hear what you're thinking yeah. on the garage and stuff. So I said you're better than me. Oh, oh you want my, i got to show you my, you got my, my main thing, guys. Oh, I forgot I mine, too. I didn't show you something. I forgot mine, too. I didn't show you something. This is our, um, our looking at property toolkit i got to show you. Hold on. This is very important. Because when you go and look at properties, this sits in my car all the time. Here's my toolkit, Dennis. My mag light. Toilet paper, because you know us girls never know when you gotta go. <laughs> uh, we even keep latex gloves yeah, in case we yeah. gotta touch mold or grab something or whatever. Crowbar in case we can't get in. Yeah. <laughs> you know, we've got um, like levels, just because sometimes, yep. of course, you can, you can usually tell they're not leveled. Hammers, just a couple little things like that. And yeah. then I also keep a bag of a variety of light bulbs in here. Oh, right, yeah. Because um, if, if a lot of times they'll take the light bulbs, so they don't have them. Um, and a lot of them don't have power on. But if they do have power, they don't have this, so we can screw them in. So we'll go in with this. Hey, you said it's a good uh, part. Are you down here? Do you, do you want to go down there? I I'm scared of basements. I don't want like basements. So Debbie goes down. Okay, so here's the scoop. What do you think? Is this a lovely beauty thing? It does have a lot. Raise your hand. This is like the mystery spot. Okay, so here's the deal. You come in the front door. Okay. And all of this has to be blown up, opened up. Okay. Is this an addition? This is like a front porch finished in. So yeah. when, when we're done with this, it'll be all level and nice and great. It'll all look like one big thing. And so then the kitchen could be a big open kitchen with a bar counter somewhere. Yeah. Uh, and more living space. Debbie, you love this thing, don't you? He told me this is about as much as Mohawk to rehab. I for don't, him. I don't know, but I just, the only thing that concerns me is the foundation. Yeah, he already checked all that out. And he feels comfortable with it? On the outside or inside? inside. Or, yeah, he said it's not grace right. He's got to redo all that. Okay. Yeah, he's got some. And see, most people that would really scare. 
But if you've got someone who knows how to um, put those I-beams in and stuff like that, he, he said, no problem. It'll look like brand new. But all these windows have got to be placed on this side. And even over here, this side over here, they started doing the, um, the new windows and stuff like that. But see, this whole thing, I'm going to blow it all out and make it a huge open kitchen, open dining room, open. It's just cracking. He's going to write it as like a mystery space. We've said that. It's like everything. Yeah. Because see it? Like and then he'll level this all this. We won't be able to finish this. these. We won't be able to finish these because right. they're not going to be level. Right. So they're going to have to level this and then put carpet down. Yeah. Or harbor floors over whatever, but it's not worth doing. Mm -hmm. But see, look at the ceiling height. Look at the ceiling. See this little thing? That's why this has got to be all, he's got to open all that up. Yeah, that's what I know. That's real bad. Yeah, you see, it's like rainy. But he'll fix all that. Yeah, see, look at this. This is going to be a great point after. Yeah, this is what, I, I'll have to do this after. Look, see here it is like yeah. this. You have to walk through the, yeah, yeah, walk through the door like this. Yeah, exactly. Because it's kind of crooked. Look at that thing. And I normally can't see things that aren't level. Debbie's very good at that. Um, but I can see that. So, <laughs> you know, it's bad. I should hope so. I know that was bad. That oh, that was bad. Okay. So then this here. is the worst part because from there on. It's and this on. is the new addition now. Right. And, and that's that's that old part is bad. But this would be blown out. Even though it's kind of nice and newer, I would blow it out. It's just gotta go. Um, I, so I keep did the toilet. Did you buy this as a foreclosure and start to work on it or something? I don't really yeah. know. But this will go in one of our rentals. Actually, we could use that in one of our spots yeah, right now, right today. But we now are gonna go buy a dang white one. Yeah. For Naomi. I could use this. Not um, they're looking for one. That's not an expensive toilet either. No, we'll keep the toilet. Yeah. And then the shower's gotta go because he'll put a nice bathtub. There's no bathtub here. Thanks. Well, there is a bathtub around the corner. Yeah. Yeah. But it's not. You, you, we don't use linoleum. It's brand new, but it's it's blue. It's got to go. Yeah, the skylight. Yeah, probably. Like it. You like it? I mean, you know, if they replace it, I hope they could get it. That's what them. I mean. I'm just wondering if it's if you had to put deck boards down, why don't you just replace it if you don't like it? Because they only there's I only have problems. Those kinds huh? of skylights, those that leak and those that are going to leak. Yeah, that's so. true. Okay, so we might uh, do that when they're redoing that. You're right, because they got to redo a lot of drywalls. So yeah, exactly. Yeah. But um, this is a huge bathroom. I gotta figure that out. What I might do yeah. is try to figure out how to put a laundry and bath up here because it's more than enough space. And you can maybe have a laundry room right here, yeah, and, below. Really and then uh, you know come from here or um, you can just bump this wall back as a laundry right here. Or put yeah, stack, you stack a bowl if you yeah. Want to do that. Or you can even have it like you can have your bathroom right here and then have your laundry right here. Yeah, you know, inside true. the bath. Yeah, yeah. So the first floor. That actually wouldn't be bad at all either. So we'll we'll do that. Bring it up. We've got the plumbing here. And then really, these are these are good size bedrooms. This is. Any light fixtures I've replaced? These are this stuff is brand new. Uh, they started doing some of this. Yeah. And then um, this is kind of where the old was. Yeah. And makes new. And then see back in here is going to be I think a master, but uh, this staircase is very 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 steep, which you'll see when we go upstairs. That's got to be uh, dropped. So it is going to either impact that. See, this is like this. It's either going to go like that, oh, right, or it's right, going to go right. back like that. Uh, Ray's going to redo that whole staircase. Did you go up there? Yeah. Yes, I did. This is actually a four bedroom, but I'm going to make it a five. Are you making well, it up there? A little teeny one. I'm going to put a closet in the back, and we'll call it an office or a bedroom. But I don't know what's the width have to be for a bedroom. It's only six foot. It's only six foot. Well, you can't really call it a bedroom because people are going to be extremely disappointed. Well, it'll say six foot in the measurements. I know, but they don't look at that. They think five bedrooms. Wow, I wouldn't do that. Okay, I'll put possible fifth bedroom. It yes. does have a closet, but it's small. Better, yes. better be an office. Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's go upstairs. Yeah. I feel like you're drunk in this house. <sighs> okay, so. Uh, like my grandma's house. Yeah, see, you know, this, yeah. see how this is. Um, There's plenty of room here to either pull it out this way or to, there's room up there to kind of drop this down and make it a normal staircase. But he'll open all this up and make it a normal stair. Can you, stand up, like, hmm? Can you stand up up there? Can you stand up up there? Oh, okay. yeah. I can stand up in most places though, you know. Yeah, so we'll make this up. This is actually a, well, it's not really like, really good, but it's so it's spoke a lot here. But it'll make us, you know, it's got a closet. So it'll be, a, it'll be the fourth bedroom. And over here, it can be like an office. I mean, with the floor, the floor seems kind of squishy. I mean. He'll, he'll figure it all. If it, anything like that, he'll fix he it. He just fixes it? Okay. He just fixes it. And then see this, because there's room in this landing, I think it's going to go this way. I think the staircase will come up to here. 
this is her room. And in this room, this lovely pink room, is uh, you can if you put a closet back there, it could be a, a it could be used as a bedroom or it could be used as a little office. Yeah, or a sitting room or something. Something, you know, yeah. like a little playroom, kids room. Yeah. But yeah, you see like this is like that old, but it won't creak or be like this at all when it's done. It'll all be all done. But yeah, you better watch that hand. This is where you need your gloves. You know, like touching stuff that like this. We always have to wash our hands. Okay, then here's the other bathroom. And that, that'll be, so you get all this area will be blown up as much as possible. But we pretty much we did this too. Yeah. But see this if we don't if we don't keep this vanity here, then we'll um this is a rental, right? It'll go on a rental. Yeah. yeah, we we have a storage unit in Oxford, Debbie and I have quite a few rentals and we'll just put it in there for this usable. Is a good idea. But so if it's good enough for a rental, we'll keep it. If it's but if it's not good enough for rehab, we'll get it. And I don't think it's good enough for a rehab. But anyways, and then these, they'll figure out something to make this. This is actually good old storage, but they'll clean them up and make them look beautiful beauteous. Is it suppressive? Do you like the before? Now, is this scary, Dennis? No, no. I mean, it, it, it's like my dad says, just needs a money transfusion. Yeah, yeah money trans. Anything can be fixed with enough money. Yeah, exactly. What did Ray quote you? Um, he didn't really quote it full, but he said, I said, Ray, I, I gotta know just approximately. Right. Because a lot of the stuff that he does tends to be about 14 to 16 grand, but that does not include the kitchen, it includes the installation of the kitchen. No, it doesn't your, include, yeah, it doesn't include any extra electrical or the roof or the windows or, you know, uh, but it does include all materials. And so he said, I said, well, how would this one be? And he said, it's probably gonna be about 15. He goes, but don't quote me exactly, but it's not far off. It's about what your normal is. To turn this into... No, that's that's just his... Like, his no, his and materials, except for, uh, it's not gonna be the siding or the roof. It's not the kitchen or the okay, granite. So, so that's about another... So you're probably talking 35. See, I told you. My estimate, 30. Okay. Hers, 35. I was going to say 30, so I'm going to have so. Well, and I said 30, but the only, and I, you know what, it could go to 35 because I don't know about the well and septic. And then he's well, without, okay, more. without the well and septic, then 35 all in for the, for the rehab to well, make it make it look beautiful. I mean, know, floors, all nine yards. you get a house this old, you are going to run into issues. Oh, sure. Do not right. Into it. Yeah. Did, did you see anything in the basement that was distressing? I mean, you're going to go down there, come on. Well, yeah. I mean, yeah. A lot. Let's go down where the Well, I mean, well, the thing is that I think he said that he can fix the structural thing. He said the structural foundation the stuff. Do you guys buy foundation problems at all or no? Just so you know. Oh, no, not really. I mean, everything can I be good. Right. No matter what. See, he's a hot water heater is brand new. He said the furnace looks, I don't like spiders, so I, I really don't like to go down the basement. No, it's brand new. It's clean. Brand new. But that's brand new. He said this, he said the plumbing looks brand new. Wow. Brand see all this new. copper? He said it all looks brand new. So can you see that? Windows, yeah, copper. See, so it, it'll be nice, and then with the dehumidifier, see so they have a dehumidifier, but it's not on because their power's off. So mm -hmm. I told you, look at that power box. Dennis, how many amps do you think are in that? Like 500. <laughs> <laughs> That's a big box. Let's see. See, the power is off. Oh, look at that right second. Part. That's the same. They just use oh, the big, big box. That's all. It looks impressive anyway. But so he, what he's worried about, um, just so you know, he said like these poles right here, Yeah, but they're, they're not even supported on the right foundation. So all of this has to be redone, these little posts. Mm -hmm. well, these are just wood too? See, look how he's got them. Well, 1890 oh. they would be. You oh, know. so these are jacked right here. Right? And yeah, they, see, yeah. they're not right. So he's going to redo all see of those. Here, I mean, there's just a lot of, yeah, they're not right. But well, all the well, stuff all work is new. Right. See, he's a step work that looks all new. Look at this, they double. See? Right, but that's just temporary. They're, right? no, yeah, that's, no. No, that's the way they lived with it. Yeah, but that's seriously. Be, that's, yes, that's, that's why he's. That's got to be redone. Really? Yeah. That's what I'm saying. No, he's I'm redoing all that. Oh my god. See, but your average buyer would freak out. I figured this is just where what the guy did before, who's just no. kind of bracing it. No, he's going to fix it permanently. Yeah. But newer plumbing. So yeah. a lot of mechanicals oh, are very yeah. good. Yeah, a lot of new um, electrical down. Yeah, he said all the electrical, the plumbing, yeah. and the um, heating. He said look pretty new. That's not bad. That's a nice head start, right? So that's good. Yeah. Yeah. But then, then you, you know, all the, I, the to me, all the, the roof. I mean, that's does it need a roof? Yeah, it does. Okay. So, so I'll come here and let's see what you think on the roof. That's and then let's that's, talk about that's an expensive item there, and getting worse. Well, it is because the asphalt is very expensive now. Mm -hmm. okay, let me lock the front door. Now people brought this back door. Oh wow, man, they got the roof there. 
Coast. I called them. I called yesterday because I was here. Oh, the back, you mean? And, um, and do you want there was no maintenance? Yeah, we'll walk out this way. Oh, okay. I'll call and I, I, I called because um, there's no power on in here, and that back door was unlocked. And I, so I called the agent because it hadn't been looked at for two months. And I, they have a little maintenance sheet in the bank home stuff where you can see who's been in. And they hadn't been in for two months, so I called her and she's like, thank you. Well, they, they came yesterday. And it was locked in. This works now. And of course, since I'm buying it, I wanted to make sure it stays locked. Did the 35 include the drive? Yes. Yeah, I, I, I say 30. I raised it 25 to 30. But he doesn't do all my other stuff. So, let's see what she says about it. Uh, and see the, the uh, arrow looks decent. Yeah. Let's see you what don't, she says. You don't replace the drive base fine like it is. Well, I'm going to put some gravel in. Oh, but you're not going to have concrete. Well, I did estimate for about a few thousand for asphalt, maybe. Oh, that's okay. nice, man. I don't know. You don't think? So I don't know. I'm, and then I was thinking about putting a deck off in here because there's nowhere to sit back here. Yeah. You don't have to sit back here. I was thinking, like, this, this is that master bedroom area. So I was thinking about putting a little deck rack in here. It looks really, really nice in there. You know, look at yeah. and then and then mm -hmm. of course it needs the shutters and it needs curb appeal on the front because it's a boring white farmhouse yeah. so it's got to have shutters it's got to have the roof's got to have some color in it uh and that'll make it look well, a lot better work like a short farmhouse it's just looking exactly yeah right. yeah and if we do enough updates we might actually be able to get the built date change from 1890 to something new if you pull permits and you could show substantially most of the stuff's been done since you know Wait, current yeah, times yeah. yeah that can change the wow. effective date yeah the effective date because if there's enough change, then it's really not it's an 1890s farmhouse. Because see, all this is, or newer anyways. So now if you just get this. But see, I'm thinking like, okay, see all of this over here, that's a big garage too. Mm -hmm. um, it's bigger than a two car, which is good, mm -hmm. but it's more expensive for the roof. And you can tell it's tarped. So it's definitely all new decking. That's two grain right there on that roof. Wouldn't you agree on that? And then I put, um, I put five grand for this. For that. But maybe that's a little low, six maybe. So it's about eight, seven or eight grand for the roofing. Um, for the siding, Debbie, I put, because um, you got to side the garage, side that. And I think I put, well, it's about 170 a square right now or something around there, 150, 170 a square installed. I, I stick by my 35. Do you? Okay, but see, that's gut. You're not telling him why. So come on, well, is, talk is the 130 it. or 130 square for the siding installed or this material? Installed. Okay. okay, well, let's talk. Okay, let's say it is 35. So I, I, I'm going to go with Debbie because I'll tell you why. She's usually right. Jesus, I told right. you. So she said that on camera, too. Did she? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Write that down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She'd be like, I'm going. She usually is. And so uh, I'd like, like to get her opinion because let's say it is 35. Good. I pay 52. This is going to be, we're going to have 87 all in. What will it be worth done? If it's a primo, you know, Ray done, opened up, not looking like that crappy thing. Four bedrooms, two baths with a basement and a big garage of 8.8 acres on a busy street. On a busy street, which is going to kill you. Wow. 120? That's what I'm thinking. 115 to 125, depending on how it, how it turns out. It's going to be beautiful. Beautiful, okay. Debbie. Okay. I think 125. I don't think that's bad. So that's why I said, you know, it's not, um, it's still 30 grand. Right. Yeah, yeah right. So yeah. I'm like, okay, well, that's, you know, and if worst mm -hmm. case, and let's say it's even extra, maybe 25. Mm -hmm. I, you know, look, I'm not digging. I mean, it's not, we normally like to make more. Right. Especially when you go into that price of 52. I mean, if you get it for 35, it's a little bit different. But when you're paying 52 and you got more in it and yeah. more. You know. So you'd like to make 25 when you get to, when you're above 50 or whatever, you'd like to make 25 on your deals on? Is that I would like to make at least 30, 35. 30. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. Mm -hmm. but, it's, but, but right now the market's a little tight, right? right? We're not having, you know, there's not a million, much inventory. For flips. So that's right. why I, I thought, you know what, I'm going to grab it because... Right. It's still a payday, right? I mean, it's a payday. Yeah. See, you, this is what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. 